E aí galera, Luiz Lopes no último episódio da retrospectiva do Salto by Salto West 2023. E a gente vem com o final mais do que é. Primeiro a gente lembra a conversa com Billy King and the Bad Bad Bad. Banda lá local de Austin, rock and roll. Mergulhamos depois no universo cabeça do Tangerine Dream, lenda alemã da música eletrônica. E fechamos muito, muito bem com a formação original do The Zambies, ícones do rock psicodélico dos anos 60, aquela banda do hit Time of the Season. Billy King is what my grandfather went by. I never got to meet him. He had passed away long before I was born. Okay. Um, but I always liked it. And everyone, when they talked about him, they said Billy King. And I thought that was a cool name. And one day I was just trying to come up with band names. And I thought about like Grave Danger and okay. The Summoners. But I was thinking that if I chose one of those names, I might get stuck to a certain genre. Sure. And so I didn't want to be, you know, trapped by being defined in a certain genre or realm. So I was thinking one day, because I loved alliteration and repetition, Billy King and the Bad, 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 and then it just stuck. For a person like me, that will be the first time there will be How can you describe the, the experience of the concert? Well, usually it's divided in two parts, you may say. First, there's quite a lot of Tangerine Dream pieces from all decades, except the 90s. And usually then, after depends, after an hour 40 or two hours, um, then we go off stage and bow, and then we start a session, which is depending on how much time we have, which is usually 30 or 40 minutes, or if we have more time than more. I find it very exciting, also unusual, to first play pieces that are pretty much defined and that we wouldn't want to change too much because they're compositions that, you know, everything that was before your time, Absolutely. none of us wrote it. So, you know, of course we reinterpret them sonically a bit different, but it needs to stay the piece itself. And then in the end there comes the total freedom, which is just different every night. And we only agree, or usually the chief just says let's do a certain BPM and a certain ground tonality and then we just start and that's exciting. It was a very different time in a way because it was before Mar Martin Luther King was killed and it was very much a coming together of black artists and white artists at that time was much less segregation in terms of what people um, were prepared to accept. It was a great time of coming together. And, and there were always a lot of black people in our audience in those days. And, and today, even now, after we saw a real change after Martin Luther King was killed, um, there was a great depression in the black community. And I can imagine that, and I can imagine why. Um, and suddenly, we didn't used to get black people in, in the rock and roll audiences. And I thought that was such a shame, but at the time, In 1964, people like Patti LaBelle really became friends with us. Espero que tenham curtido esse programa, essa série de programas Lembrando 2023. E fiquem ligados, aqui no The Shows, aqui no Zona Curva, uma cobertura muito mais completa esse ano do Salto by Southwest 2024. Valeu, galera! Música